my teeth. Ugh, let's just keep going. Don't worry, I've got tiny oranges. This is my best friend, Scott Dinoga. <laughs> the tiny oranges did nothing! This here is a squid I've always wanted to rescue. And these two weirdos are Sparky and Zoot from the Hot 95 Morning Radio Party Patrol. Every week, they of course did the psychic squid pick the winners of high school football games. Which is why I put liberating him on my list of stuff I always wanted to do. I'd say we lost him. Time, cones, art! Oh, are you telling me to avoid those things? Run! Up until a week ago, I never would have actually gone through with this. I'm not really the kind of person who likes to try new things. Not happening. Maybe next year. Oh, no, 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 no. But that all changed back on New Year's Eve. Five, four, three, two, one! Resolution time! This year, I'm gonna stop wasting my afternoons watching parkour fails online and start doing my own parkour fails. Wabba! Woohoo! Nailed it! Well, my resolution is equally exciting. I'm going to finally enter one of my handmade birdhouses into the largest birdhouse building competition on the West Coast. Home, tweet home. That's awesome, Haley. I really believe you think you're gonna do that. Although, now that I look at it, my lattice work is still builder grade. What if I get there and everyone hates it? And they laugh at me? And then one of the judges throws my birdhouse into the dumpster? But there was a bird still in there because no one checked and now I'm a bird murderer! You're doing it again. What? That thing where you talk yourself out of doing something cool! No, I'm totally gonna do it eventually. In fact, I'm gonna write it down in my big list of things I'm totally gonna do. Haley, you've been working on that list since the first grade and you haven't crossed off a single item. Yeah, well, this year's gonna be different. In fact, that's gonna be my New Year's resolution, to do every single thing on my list. Now you're talking. You know, something tells me this is gonna be the year we both make our dreams come true. Parkour! I'm okay. Whoa. Okay, where did you come from? And what the heck was that? Chaos bot. And it was sent here to stop you, Haley Alokilani Banks, from completing the most important document in history. Hey, it's my list, but everything's crossed off. Where'd you get this? From the future. You know, I almost didn't bring this keytar. Glad I did. If you're really from the future, prove it. Fine, in 3.8 seconds, Ryan Seacrest will get hit by a pigeon live on TV. Whoa. But that could have just been a coincidence. Fine, you don't believe me, maybe you'll believe you. Hi, Haley. It's, well, you. Haley, future you. Hi. Whoa, future me, is that really you? Sorry, this is a recording, so we can't actually interact. Oh, got it, okay. Yeah, sorry about that. But just to prove this is legit, I'm gonna tell you something only you would know. Back in third grade, you ate all of Scott's Halloween candy and blamed it on burglars. Anyway, I'm sure you're freaking out right now because we tend to do that, but don't. All you need to do is complete every item on our list. Yes, everything. It'll all make sense later, trust me. You got this, Haley. bye! Okay, for the record, I only lied about the candy thing to protect Scott's feelings. Yeah, I don't really care. Well, I gotta return this list to the Smithsonian. I just came to warn you about the bots, but you can keep that phone. There's a copy of the list on it. Oh, and here. Wait, my list is in the future Smithsonian? Am I, like, important? <laughs> of course you're important. Completing the list was the first step toward you saving the world. How do you not know this? Oh, right, you're not from the future. Wait, me saving the what now? Ugh, look, I'm not really supposed to give out spoilers from the future, but... Hey! Here's the 12-second summary. By completing your list, you're named San Diego County's Young Person of the Year. You win a big trophy. The mayor's there wearing his mayor sash. It's kind of a big deal. That accomplishment then catches the attention of President Serena Williams. Hold on, the tennis player? Oh, right, she did play tennis. But yes, President Williams sponsors you for an X-Grant, which you work your butt off and win by inventing a crowdsourced decarbonization device which completely reverses the effects of climate change. By the way, thanks for that! Whoa, go me! I can't believe I'm actually gonna do everything on my list. I'm gonna learn to play the glockenspiel. I'm gonna invent a new color. I'm gonna kiss Katanoga. Did you say my name, Haley? No, go away!
Okay. Jackknife! I can't kiss Scott. Oh, I wrote that back in fifth grade as a joke. As a joke for yourself. You had to be there. Okay, look. Maybe I thought Scott was cute for a hot minute when he tried that new hair gel before it got recalled for attracting bears. But that was a long time ago, and we're older now, and he's... Scott! He wears the same jeans for a month straight. He thinks the monkey wrench was invented by monkeys. He calls potato chips crispy dippers. Look, if I'd wanted all this teen drama, I'd watch the new season of Xerxes and Marnius. It's the big teen drama 50 years from now. He's a cyborg, she's an all-knowing mist. I, you know, I don't want to spoil it. Point is, I don't really care what you wrote on your list. I'm just here to tell you, if you don't do every item, you won't compete for an X grant, and climate change will continue to accelerate until the world looks like this. Aw, that doesn't look so... <gasps> it's on fire! <sighs> so yeah, there's a lot riding on your shoulders, but as long as you don't screw up, the world will be just fine. Again, no pressure, but just to recap, it's all on you. Super. Oh, and I almost forgot! To make things easier for you, I brought tomorrow's winning jackpot numbers. They are seven. <laughs> Seriously? Check it out, Hilly! I made duck lips out of crispy dippers! Quack, quack! Yeah. <laughs> Something bit my butt! Something bit my butt! <laughs> huh? Whoa! So, a couple things we should probably talk about. So I laid it all out for Scott. The box, the professor, the world potentially melting into a ball of fire, everything except the whole kissing him thing. And all she left me with was this. Enable beta features? Who are you? Who am I? Where are my legs? Am I supposed to have legs? Whoa! A screaming phone! I'm more than a screaming phone, you buffoon. I'm Beta, the world's most advanced AI, here to help Haley Banks complete her list. Oh, that's who I am. So, yeah, my year got off to a pretty weird start. And somehow, it just keeps getting weirder, trying to save the future of the world by doing things like item number 195. Free Sid, the psychic squid. That squid is property of the Hot 95 Party Patrol. Coming at you with San Diego County's hottest mix of music, sports, and talk. I'll take care of these guys. Give me a hand, Sid! Ah! Haley, over here! Yeah, one step closer to saving the world. You should take a shower. I'm gonna take a shower. Haley Banks, I've been waiting for you. Hey, Beta. How am I supposed to help you if you leave me behind for all the fun stuff? You remember Beta. He's that screaming phone from earlier. He's still pretty cranky, but he's a lot cuter now that I made him that body out of a spare robotics kit at Commander Koala plushie. Oh, and he hates it when you do this. I love you. All right, that's enough. Hey, look on the bright side. We finished another list item. Well, I guess I do love that. So. What's next on the list? Well, according to my calculations, the next item you should attempt with a 92% achievement probability is number 143, Kiss Scott Danoga. <laughs> Isn't that the buffoon who wears the same jeans every day? Whee! Why would you put that on your list? You know, I've actually been thinking about that, and I'm pretty sure I meant to write Kick Scott Danoga. So I'll just go ahead and make a quick correction to the list here. <laughs> Uh, what was that? Time glitch. A rift in the very fabric of the space-time continuum, which could give Chaos Bots an opening to jump into our timeline. So it's not a good time glitch, then? No! Haley, this item is no bigger deal than any of the others. In fact, according to my research, human kissing is quite simple. It simply involves briefly interlocking your two face holes. Oh, Beta! Look, I know you don't always get human stuff, but Scott is my best friend. And yes, part of me wonders, what if we were more than friends? But then the other part of me knows that that would risk making things totally weird between us and ruin the great thing we already have. But then that first part of me knows the truth is that I like him. 
never even said it out loud, but yes, for some reason, I like Scott DeNoga. Hey guys, what you talking about? Ah, nothing! Certainly not you, Scott. The world does not revolve around your lips. I mean, your face hole. I mean, any part of your body. <laughs> okay. You know you're sitting in glue, right? As a joke. <laughs> So, Beta, what's the next list item? As I was explaining to Haley, she's supposed to give you a, a present for Christmas, which is at the end of the year. So let's just plan to do that one later. I love you. Sure, why not? It's only the fate of the world at stake. Okay, okay. It looks like the next most optimal item is number 239. Ride every ride at the county fair. There we go. That sounds fun. Wait, did you say county fair? <laughs> <laughs> Remember the last time you went to the county fair? Yes. And you went on the Zero Gravitron and barfed in front of everyone? Yes. And Christine Sanchez accidentally live-streamed the whole thing and then everyone called you Hurley for the next month? I said I remember! That was hilarious! <laughs> I, I mean, not, not for you, for everyone else. <sighs> so, Beta, what's the next, next item? Oh, uh, come on, Haley. I know you're scared, but you can do this one. You know, I was scared once, too. Back in the third grade, after all my Halloween candy was stolen by those burglars who left the empty wrappers in your trash can. Ugh! Burglars! But the next year, I got right back out there and trick-or-treated harder than ever. I even got a king-sized Keith bar! Keith bars are disgusting. So disgusting! But it was king-sized! Point is, the county fair is nothing to be afraid of. Especially since I'm gonna be there every step of the way! Thanks, Scott. You're a great friend. But just a friend. Yeah, I know. Would you two just kiss already? Yeah, I love you. What did he say? Let's go to the fair! Okay! Time for me to scope out the premises for any suspicious activity. It's go time. Where'd you get those sunglasses? The Mr. Tomato Head doll in your closet. Now, go time. <laughs> Well, this is humiliating. Okay, Scott. Looks like it's time for us to save the world. I'm making my moves, playing my rules. That's how I do it. Season the day, there's just no way that I'm alone. Zero Gravitron, my white whale. I always thought it was a spaceship, but yeah, I can see it. Hey, look, it's almost empty. Even if you hork, nobody will ever know. Oh, no. Hey, K-Squad, it's me, Christine the Hat Queen. Today, I'm sporting a wide brim, raffia sun hat, and a vintage 2006 Lionel Verducci scarf. Hashtag thrift store gem. Christine Sanchez, the most popular girl in school with over 2,000 followers. She's stylish, she's tall, she never sweats in gym class, and the worst part of all, she's actually really nice. <gasps> Hi, Christine. Hey, hey! Can I just say how truly inspiring it is to see you back on this ride? Oh, and you brought Scott! You guys are such a cute couple. Couple? <laughs> What? Yeah. More like a couple of friends who aren't destined to kiss. <sighs> oh, uh, sorry. I just assume because you guys are so close and you hang out all the time and you have your own handshake. Because we're friends. I mean, I have handshakes with lots of people. You do? Sure. Like, board shorts here. What's up, board shorts? Catch you later, bud. OMG, can I live stream this? Your bravery would be such an inspiration to all the little Christinis out there. That sounds great. By the way, what do you think of my scarf? It's okay. 
Oh man, I want that scarf. Well, good luck! Just ignore her and her thousands of fans watching you live. You can do this. Just think calm thoughts. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to your wars! Yeah! Hold on to your personal items because they will become deadly projectiles. Don't worry, they're just building the suspense. I'm not just building the suspense, you're gonna scream till you puke! Kinda cute? I like the blue one. Death Spiral Link is not responsible for any injuries that may occur. I guess it's up to me. I'm not so fast and furious. I'm playing it safe. I like it dangerous. Go on and shoot me. Kaylee. That was amazing, Haley. I tip my hat. <laughs> okay. That was so cool. Everyone was like, ah! and you were like, Pfft. and then everyone was like, hoo, hoo, hoo. and then we got off this ride, and I started saying all this. How did you do all that? I don't know. I just did it. I guess I can do everything on my list. I can do anything. That's weird. This thing is supposed to go green when we finish a list item. Guess we're not done writing all the rides yet. Oh, look, there's a new one. The Tunnel of Love. The Tunnel of Love? You know what? I think I can do that one solo. <laughs> oh no, I promised I'd help you complete every ride and I am nothing if not a man of my word. And look, there's no line, score. Welcome to the Tunnel of Love, the most romantic six minutes of your life. Oh man, this is gonna be so lame. You've been best friends, but that'll all change tonight. So lame. I don't know, I think it's kinda cool. The moment just feels right. This romantic endeavor. This was the moment I was supposed to kiss Scott. Maybe it was the lights, or the fountains, or the weirdly on the nose music, but it was actually perfect. <laughs> Until that happened. Okay, okay, that was bad, but you've just gotta do it. You've gotta tell Scott that kissing him is on your list. Who knows? He might even be into it. What if he is into it? What if he's not into it? <sighs> Whatever. It's not the end of the world, Haley. Well, maybe it is. Hey, hey. Ah! Listen! Scott, I am so sorry. No, don't be. Check out this sweet t-shirt they gave me. This is in me. It's just painted on. <laughs> I know. Look, Scott, there's something I need to tell you about the list and our friendship and... Hey, Haley, can I ask you something? Yes, please, anything. Would you mind if I asked out Scott? What? But why? Well, we started talking in the cleanup tent, and it turns out we both have a lot in common. We both have great hair, we both got barf on us today, and our birthdays are only five and a half months apart. That's actually about as far apart as they could- So, what do you think? Um... 
I mean, sure. Why would I mind? I told you, we're just friends. Great. Hey, Scott! Do you want to go out? Sure. Thank you so much, Haley. I'll get us a cotton candy. Yay! That was cool. <laughs> yeah, so cool. Cool for you, cool for her, and cool for me. Yep, I am cool like a cantaloupe. You okay? Like a cantaloupe! Okay, so what were you saying about the list? Oh, uh, just that one of the items is that I have to kick Scott Janoka. So? Ow! Ah, that was a hard one. Well, anything to save the world. Later, hey! Not if I see you first, crocodile! Ugh. Ow! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> What is going on? Beta? Why are you... Uh-uh, not important. What is important is that according to my calculations, there's now only a 0.2% chance that you'll ever kiss Scott. What? How is that possible? Christine just asked him out. That doesn't mean they're already at... Hey, K-Squad. Meet Scott. Hi, everyone. Can you believe our birthdays are only five and a half months apart? Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. You picked the wrong day to mess with me, bots. Haley, that was the coolest thing I have ever seen you do. So that's me, Haley Banks, here to save the world. <laughs> Someday. I take it back. That was not remotely cool. Man, that was like all pinky toe. Ow. Come on, I'll buy you a churro. You don't have any money. Fine, then you buy me a churro. You don't even eat people food. 